That was Mary Alice Parks reporting. A new annual permit will allow the Wyoming Game and Fish Department to send sage-grouse hunters a harvest survey after the hunting season. In this week's Game and Fish Report, Ray Hageman says the survey will provide the department more accurate and timely information on sage-grouse harvest, and he has more in this week's Game and Fish Report. Starting this fall, all licensed sage-grouse hunters are required to carry a sage-grouse hunting permit. This permit is free, and it's intended to gather data on hunter experience in the field, in addition to annual hunter surveys that are in place. Each year, around 60,000 people hold a license to hunt game birds in Wyoming, but annual surveys of game bird license holders show just a few thousand people hunt sage-grouse each year. Until now, Game and Fish gathered sage-grouse harvest information in the spring as part of a larger survey sent out to a sample of game bird and small game license holders. The new free annual permit allows Game and Fish to send a harvest survey specifically to sage-grouse hunters shortly after the sage-grouse hunting season closes each fall, providing accurate and timely information on sage-grouse harvest to aid future management of sage-grouse. The sage-grouse permit does not serve as a hunting license. All licensed sage-grouse hunters are required to carry the sage-grouse permit in addition to their game bird license. This requirement applies to daily, annual, pioneer, and lifetime license holders. Hunters under 14 years of age will not need a permit as they do not require a license to hunt game birds. Non-residents under 14 who buy a game bird license to take their own limit will also need the free sage-grouse permit. Falconers who hunt sage-grouse will need the sage-grouse permit in addition to their falconry license and their game bird license. Permits can be obtained at Wyoming Game and Fish offices and online through the department website and can be either a paper copy from offices or it can be held electronically via mobile device. The permit will not be available at licensed selling agents, which is consistent with other free permits. Going forward, sage-grouse hunters will need to obtain the sage-grouse permit each year. The permit is valid only for the calendar year that it's issued. A permit issued September 1st will expire at the end of this year. Sage Grouse Area 1 season runs from September 21st through the 30th. Areas 2, 3, and 4 are closed this year, same as last year. Bag limits, also the same as last year. A daily limit of 2 with 4 in possession. This is Ray Hageman with the Wyoming Game and Fish Department.